Yo, yo, what's happening, people? Got some audio for this one. Y'all tuning in, foe, Total War, Warhammer 2. Actually, I think I have audio on my RNS one, but this is Total War Warhammer 2. And we got the Witch King. Along with his hot mama Marathi, right here, riding Solifet, and um, we about to take Bleak Hole Fortress. It's gonna be an easy one, but I figured I'd broadcast it just because Malkith and Marathi, mother and son, and we're killing the hated ass of our rivals. So let's get it. But yeah, my last two vids had Aranessa um, riding the great sea monster um, Aminar, which is an amazing mount. That motherfucker is huge. So be sure to check that out on the channel. And I have Malice Darkblade on another one with some Witcher 3 music in the background. I figured I'd get creative on that one. So y'all can check that out too. Here we go. Marathi's charging in with her force. Scourge Runners pull back. Alright, I'm gonna pull Malekith right in on him. Pull up a Seraphon. Actually, you know what? I'm just gonna breath this random unit right here. And he can just kill that Phoenix by himself, probably. Yeah. Because he killed an Omen of Asarian by himself in this campaign. Oh yeah, we got some unique units too going on, which I thought would be awesome to show off. The Daughters of Despair right here. They're pretty fucking sick. There's only 18 of them for a reason. Got the SFO mod going on, which makes everything better, pretty much. They got wrecked. And a whole bunch of other mods. I know this is an SFO unit. Alright, bring that battering ram up, Marathi. Appreciate you. Knock that tower down. Oh my god. <laughs> He's obliterating this phoenix. Pull back. Daughters of Despair. Alright, good shit. Yeah, climb up there. The Death Dealers, they got a dope flag, which gives them fear and terror. You know I gotta pack Malekith up with all those Black Guard. Alright, let's go fight those White Lions by yourself, it's all good. We'll just flex on these ass, so they ain't shit. An old one's gonna burn soon. I'm not sure if I'm gonna do a playthrough, just because my Malice campaign, I had to start over because, goddamn, the dwarves and the Empire were taking over the world, and it would have taken forever. <laughs> so... For now, I'm just comfortable doing battles. Probably until, yeah, probably until the DLC comes out, because we got Torax coming, and Oxyodal for the Lizardmen. Yeah, Torax the Brass Bull for the Beastmen, I can't fucking wait, bro. The last DLC, until Warhammer 3, which I'm crazy about. 
Obviously, because this is my favorite game of all time. Right next to Halo. Oh, hey, Mom. Yeah, screenshot right there. Better kick some ass, because I'm going to kick your ass and Agaron again if you don't. Yeah. Use that Pegasus. So the fit. That's what I like to see. <laughs> I wonder who. I wonder how many people believe like Malik is just like fucks Marathi on the low. <laughs> Be interesting. I bet. Because since all the sources are supposed to be Malika's wives and Marathi is a sorceress technically, even though that's Malika's mother. And he's probably bent over a couple times. Don't run yet, you fools. I have more of Kane's deliverance for you. And that noxious breath. <laughs> I gotta see the daughters of despair go at it. Very nice, very nice. Good night. It's a really cool map too, like there's the bleak hole fortress right there. I just can't wait for Warhammer 3 for them to like open up the maps more so we can actually explore it all. <clears throat> Just smack Silafet's butt with Seraphon's tail. I bet a dragon fucking a Pegasus. Nah, a dragon would be way too dominant. The Pegasus would die. Like. <laughs> <laughs> oh, stop. Silafet and Seraphon coming in just like the dawns. I do have a warmer song, I could check that in the description. Really appreciate some love on that. If y'all fuck with bars, y'all fuck with it. Me and Marathi carving through. <laughs> wow, they laughed with me. I gotta see him kill something now. <laughs> I'm dead. Yeah, nothing too crazy. Just a little something something. There's the chill of Sontar. Breath. And we peep the daughters. Yeah, nice. They're the one unique unit. Oh, yeah, and then Karan Darkhand, I didn't mention. The captain of the Black Guard. Nice. Good. 
Yeah, they, as you can see, they have a splash attack, which is really good. Yeah, I like the sound effects when they attack. It must be like a heavy weapon sound effect that they used, but they have two blades, which makes it really cool. Here we go, Karan. He's got a lot of dope shit going on. How many kills did he get? Oh, just one. <laughs> yeah, but he looks good. The Crimson Death Axe. Lots of dope shit. He's got some legendary items. Dope ability that just makes him pretty OP. Obviously, he's unbreakable. And we're all good. Where's mom? She flew off somewhere. Bit done flew off. Oh, just chasing some shit down. Very nice. Yep, that'll do it. bother doing a replay because as you can see yeah, it was pretty much a certain victory two hundred five kills from Mali forty nine for the daughters thirty for the chill sons are nice huh <laughs> 30 30 30 with the Reaper bolt throwers Nice, nice, nice. We'll see how many Marathi got on the campaign map. And her squad. Yeah, sir, did pretty much nothing. Of course. I can show y'all a little bit of the campaign too, like... Because I'm going to be doing, um... I'm definitely going to be doing a few more battles for the channel on this campaign, so I'll do a quick, like, overview of, of like, what's going on. Then I got more Aranessa, and I got, uh, Throt the Unclean coming. That's my Vortex campaign. Yeah, this and Aranessa are my two Mortal Empire ones. So, yeah. <clears throat> Only three I'm going to be doing until Torox and Oxyodal drop. I forget what the actual name of the DLC is called, but... Bruh, it's so... It looks so good. Oh man. I know the third game they dropped Scarbrand, they dropped some corn units, they dropped some Kislev. It's all really exciting. I follow Milk and Cookies as far as that. Y'all should definitely check him out. He covers news Warhammer news very well. He does like mainly multiplayer battles. He only does, like, campaign with, like, new shit. So, um, definitely check Bull out. You'll get a lot of information from him. It looks exciting. We got Scarbrand coming. I'm hoping, like, you know, because they're supposed to be doing, like, demons, I guess. Like, CA said, they're going to be doing demons to start out. And the mortals are coming later, so like Valkia the Bloody, who's like my favorite bitch from the Corrin side. Um, well, she's like the only female that serves Corrin, I think. <laughs> but she's one of my favorite females in Warhammer Fantasy, and I think she's going to come later. 
along with, you know, some new corn shit. But, you know, we got... But for now, we got, like, the Exalted Blood Letters. We got the Blood Thirsters, of course. You know, we have regular Blood Letters. We got, um... What, the Blood Crushers? Uh... Try to remember as much as I can. We got, like, this one thing. It looks kind of like Warhammer 40k-ish. I forget what it's called, but it's like a... It's like a demon with, like, spider legs. <laughs> and it's so fucking hardcore, bro. It's so metal. And, like, each... Chaos guy is gonna have it. <laughs> I think it's called a soul grinder, yeah. That thing looks devastating bro it looks so cool it's like a goddamn demon fused into like a machine <laughs> metal bro Top makes this game a little slower, but it's all good. Later this year, I'm gonna be getting a new laptop, so yeah, but I'm pretty Gucci right now. Four hundred and twelve. Look at you, girl. She must have been blasting some spells. I didn't see. The cold one's wrecked. All right. Ransom up. <clears throat> so. Yeah, I'm going to confederate her soon. But yeah, at this point in the campaign, Chaos has invaded. I actually just finished a series of siege defenses and stopped Chaos from taking down Nagaroth. It was pretty challenging. So, shouts out to Venerus on the SFO mod for that. Like, they had Chaos God-type units that SFO brought in, like, the fucking... The Guardians of the Dark Prince's Desires, so Slanesh, the uh, Sons of the Last Plague, Nergol, Chosen Berserkers, Korn, and then... I actually didn't see any... I don't think I saw any Zinch ones, but I know the Zinch ones, because I did Chaos SFO before, they're the, um... Heralds of Zinch, I think, and they're like eight mages that can just do a bunch of like crazy spells. I think they can even summon like a Lord of Change, but they have to like sacrifice a unit to do it. <laughs> some pretty dope shit. That's some shit they're gonna be doing Warmer 3 to like summon demons, so I can't wait for that. But yeah, that's pretty much what's going on. Um,. I'm about ready to attack Ulthuan. That's probably where my next... Yeah, that's going to be where my next... Uh... Oh? Yeah, so... <laughs> There's one right there. <laughs> yeah, so this is where I'm going to stop. I just want to do that. Um... You know, it's kind of tempting. Just because they're like new units. Alright, I'll do it. 
Why not? Because this will be a tougher one. Okay, fuck it. Hold up, I'm gonna be right back. Yeah, let's fucking get it. I hope I don't lose. Ugh. It'll be fun. Thinking about doing, like, the quest, though, like, where Malekith fights Tyrion. Like, I'm thinking about it right now, I might. <clears throat> that would certainly be replay worthy. Yeah. Yeah, I could do that. <clears throat> it's gonna be right before I attack, before I invade Ulthuan. So yeah, I could do that for a replay vid, and then like my third fight from this campaign will be like somewhere on Old Fawn. Sounds pretty dope. I know SFO made some changes to that quest too. It'll be a little tougher than vanilla. So that's sick. And yeah, as you can see, Chaos has a lot of new dope shit. Yeah, the green ones are the Sons of the Last Pig, the purple are the Sunesh ones. Then they got Renowned Dragon Ogres, they got the Word Spawn. Word. <laughs> That's just like my joke for like the Word Spawn, just like, Word. Word, it's the Word Spawn. I just wish it could like shoot lightning out of its mouth, because it's actually technically supposed to do that. <clears throat> Speaking of lightning... <laughs> yeah, Summoners of Rage are pretty dangerous. Okay. Yeah, now I haven't decided the order in which I'm going to do this. I'm gonna do like my uh, viz with like. Wait, hold on. I need to set this up before I finish that point. Hold on. Okay, yeah, I haven't decided, like, what the order is going to be when I'm going to be doing, um, like, whether I'm going to do, like, Aranessa before I do Malchus Quest, um, or if I'm going to do Throt next, we'll see, but it's all coming, so stay tuned. Alright, I need to take these towers down. Oh, I got another, like, wherever song, too. Like, I have two of them in there, so check both of them out. 
But the Warhammer 3 Fantasy one is better. Because <laughs> that one I'm hyping up Warhammer 3. Okay. I need to take these towers down. Hit the Sons of the Last Plague. They're tank monsters. This fucking hell cannon. Ah, oh, shit. I'm not sure what to do about that. If I lose, I lose, but it'll be a good fight. Just take that giant down. Alright, got off. Chaos Warriors. The rest of them, we can let them climb up. Here's the thing. Alright, kill that giant. Almost there. Hopefully the tower can reach the Hell Cannon. It's like just in range, bro. Ah. Uh, I don't know. It's red, so I don't think so. Ah, you pieces of shit. Well, I think it's just trying to break the wall down, so it's fine. We're just gonna have to let them destroy it. Giant's dead, though. Who we shooting at? Okay. Word, 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 word. Light him up, light him up. Where are my other shooters? And bows. Go that way. This will work better on these guys. Okay. Good. Dark conduit. I gotta be real smart about that. Ah, shit. No, no. Go back. Go back. Go back. No, no. Not you guys. The hambos. The hambos. Where are they at? Okay, yeah. We need to shoot them up. And then... Okay, y'all could go on the side. Ah, we're getting them away from the gate. That's fabulous. Sorry if my voice is a little too loud during the slow-mo, but... I don't broadcast on PC as often as Xbox, so <laughs> I'm sure it's fine, though. Uh, yes, Sunrise of Rage are getting annihilated. That's why I'm so good at Juki defenses, because, like, Dark Shards, Armor Piercing is dumb good. Plus, they have the shields. And then get me Corsairs on top of that. I'm cooking with gas. And we have good range, so, like, yeah. Dark Shards aren't the worst in melee. Obviously... Corsairs are way better, but yeah. What's the have demonic strength? Oh shit. That's an SFO ability. Damn. Okay. We could deal 
Let's keep shooting. Ah, oh, what's this? Ah, oh, shit. Shoot them up, shoot them up, shoot them up. I don't care about... Wait. Shade, shoot the sons of the last plague. Y'all need to shoot them. They might break in. Three percent. All right. Screw these aspiring champions. Yeah, see how OP they are, SFO. I just arcane condo. They still have eleven. Like, what is life? Oh. <laughs> okay, they're about to break the. About to get murderous prowess. Did they break in? Oh shit, I didn't realize that. Some of the cold ones now? Right now? Uh. Alright, I'm sending the shades off. They can use their great swords. We got Mars Prowse, good timing. Yeah, y'all just shoot the fucking Sons of the Last Plague, thank you. Yeah, taking a while to break that wall. Good. Summers of Rage are gone. Hell cannons within range. Start hitting it. Pull up right on the side. Hit him. Ha! Ah, I think we got this. How we doing over here, B? Oh. Get him good. She's winning, she's winning. I'll have to hit him with a really good flank. Nice jump. Fuck yeah, dude. Okay. Now pull the shades out. Get ready to start firing. Yeah, we got this. Back to normal. Ooh, we could stop the hell cannon. Spiring champions are gone. Get on those chosen. Oh. I'm gonna give her a quick break. Just cause she has light armor. Yep, so they gate. We stopped them. Ha, we stopped them at 90%. Now they're coming for the gate. Let's kill that word spawn quick. Ooh. 
We won. <clears throat> Hell yeah. Good. Alright. Just block the gate. Oh. Oh shit, I know that's fuck. Ah! ah! That shit's dangerous. Ooh. Yeah. Marathi starts with that on SFO. And Zippo's Black Horror, that's what it's called. Alright. Victory! Yeah, most of the action was in slow mo. But, yeah. It was good. <laughs> Shot up a lot of shit like this pussy lord. Bye bye. <laughs> ah, very good. We gotta get rid of those chosen before we end it. They're too dangerous. Oh, that was a little bit like bleak hold. Oh, so those are just regular Juki fortresses then? Hmm. Well, technically, last one was bleak hold, but yeah, it looks the same. <laughs> looks nice. I just want to explore. I want to go inside, you know? Alright, what's up with those chosen. Oh, you gave up. Nah, I'm not the arcane conduit them. <laughs> nah, nah, nah. Slow it down. Wait, you need to get arcane conduited. <laughs> One second, bub. Right now. <laughs> Always so satisfying. That's power in the game. Sweet. Okay. Alright, I'll do it for the stream, folks. Thanks for tuning in. Um... Just looking at the kill count. Word. Yeah, we dominated them. Definitely a heroic victory. I just shot the shit out of them. There was nothing they could really do. Towers murked. We had the walls on lockdown, so that was really good. And of obviously Arcane Conduit. So, yeah, man. Uh, stay tuned for some more Tower of Warhammer 2, Druki, SFO, and lots of other dope mods going on. Uh, I stopped, like, putting up, like, my mod collection, mainly because, um, well, I put it up when I did like my Rakarth playthrough, but now I have kind of like a new set for my three new campaigns, so um, yeah, I'll have them for this vid and upcoming ones, so y'all yeah, check it out. I hope it doesn't crash for you. I think you'll have a lot of fun with it. Um, 
And yeah. The Witch King and a Money Piece and out. See you on the next one. <laughs>